wanted to ask if you guys had a take on this, but where have the Kardashians been? I feel like we haven't seen anything from them. I mean, I know the Hulu show isn't running right now, and I feel like with that we get a little bit of glimpse, but it's stuff that's happened like six months to a year ago, so it's kind of kind of over it. But I feel like even their social media presence just hasn't really been there. So I wonder if you guys had a take on that. Love you guys. Talk to you. Love you too. Thank you. Great question. Mm-hmm. I have my answer because I literally just thought about this two oh. days ago when I saw Kim Kardashian at the, at on the Oscars thing or on, whatever as Academy of yeah when she music? what was it? Well, there was one for the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, and then there was another one that was a yeah. different night, which had yeah. me confused. But she was on the red carpet, and I thought to myself, "Huh, haven't seen Kim in a while." Yeah. I don't want to get too conspiracy theorists, but when all this. Mm. When all this Diddy news broke, there was a mm-hmm. lot of rumblings about the Kardashians. And now I don't know if there's any correlation here. I don't know what's going on, but they have been pretty quiet. Yeah. I'm honestly like terrified to mention anybody's names. Like a lot I almost feel like we have to speak in code when talking about that whole It's all a situation. very like I'm not saying 100%. that they're a part I'm all, just saying that people yeah. immediately when this came out yeah. started throwing their names in the mix. Like and, it was it was almost immediate. And jumping on the conspiracy thing completely. Once again, mass it's all total conspiracy. But did you see all the comments on Kim's video because when she posted the outfit of the Mugler, like the full like mm-hmm. fit and everything, the song was a Beyonce song. And it was hate oh. low. And all the comments are like, this is your way of thanking Beyonce. If you don't know right now, a very brief description of this conspiracy that's running around is that there's everyone's noting like celebrities at certain points or different times in the past years that they've like won awards or had speeches where they've always like kind of gone out of their way to mention Beyonce. And they think people think that there's something sus going on with that. Yeah. And... So now, like, anytime Beyonce is mentioned by anyone, all the comments are like, thank you, Beyonce. Or, like, everybody's like, yes, this is me thanking Beyonce. Like, I don't want to get in trouble either. Thank you, Beyonce. Mm -hmm. And Kim posted the song with the Beyonce song. Like, posted the video with the Beyonce song. And all the comments are like, thank you, Beyonce. Thank you, Beyonce. (laughs) I I didn't include this voicemail because I, you know, I was a little sensitive. It's what you're talking about. But someone was saying, like, there's a rumor now going around that Kanye actually was saving Taylor Swift when no, I the... saw the Ugh. same exact videos, which is just insane. Kanye West. That one, that one's not going to get Ka- me. No, me either. Kanye West is a piece of shit. Yeah. So I'm not going to sit here and act like Kanye West was saving anybody. Taylor or anybody by getting on that stage. I think I think Kanye West was saving himself yeah. from Beyonce, if anything. I don't think he was saving Taylor. I think, if anything, he's getting up there and doing what everybody else is doing mm-hmm. if, the, if it flows into that conspiracy that he now has to thank Beyonce as well and say how good Beyonce is. Speaking, How of, would that be saving Taylor? Yeah, that's, no, that's saving himself crazy. for Beyonce. I think the... Um, I think the... Honestly, I think the Kanye of it all... Um, has a lot to do with the mm-hmm. Kardashians as well. Maybe not all the rest of them, but specifically with Kim. Like, I just feel like things have been more quiet with Kim. And I have seen articles of like, oh, Kim's, you know, really taking on that that parent role like 100%. Like, Kanye's mm-hmm. not around that much. I would just imagine when Kanye's like in the news every single day for some ridiculous thing or like him and his wife, him and his air quotes wife are married not married divorced yeah. broken up he wants to sleep with his his wife's mom he wants to they're they're wearing they're wearing clothes they're wearing no clothes like all that is like just so loud and messy that i feel like <laughs> you're you're probably they're like, wearing clothes they're wearing they're wearing no clothes yeah i mean some you know sometimes <laughs> they're clothed sometimes they got no clothes on <laughs> you never you never know what you're yeah. gonna get yeah. and i like i could see like Kim just wanting to not be a part mm-hmm. of any n- any part of that narrative at all that it's just like things have been things have been a little bit more quiet. I mean, granted Northwest just had a full fucking cover story, so that is she's seen been seen the most. Kendall and Kylie, I feel like this is their dream. Like to live their life and not have chaos happening at all times or like mm-hmm. crazy news stories happening at all times. Right. 